everybody laughs. Good morning, sir. It's nice to see you today. Thank you. Thank you. So, uh, last time we talked about organisms. We all know already that we are organisms. Of course, we are living, we are breathing, we are considered living. So, we are organisms. Today, we are going to talk about the things that each organism is made of. Ano ba ang mga mamubuo sa mga organisms like us and also like other animals at may mga mga plants. Okay? So, it falls under the topic of what we call as the levels of biological organization. Why it is called level? Because it is composed mula sa pinakamaliit hanggang sa pinakamalaking uh, part na bumubo sa ating katawa. For example, yeah, we fast. Okay? So today, yung topic natin, we will only deal with animals. Tomorrow will be plants. Okay? So since kasi ang animals is uh, mas malaki siyang topic, so we are going to talk about the animals. The levels of biological organization in animals. So, including us, because we are also animals. Okay, so before we go on to that topic, let's talk about the ball pen analogy. I know you all know what ball pen looks like. Nakakita na ba kayo ng ball pen? Yes, sir. <laughs> okay, so um, where do we use a ball pen? Or when do we use a ball pen? Or how do we use a ball pen? So its primary reason or its primary function is to write, ama. Ginagamit natin ito pang sulat. Ano? Like note, jot down notes. Katulad ng ginagawa ni Shimaila. We also use this to to write letters. Okay. So what do you think would happen if we disintegrate the ball? Kapag tinanggal natin ng iba mga Ah, bumubuo sa kanya. Hindi lang kaya. So, ayan. Let's disintegrate. Ang galing natin ang uh, ball pen. At hindi na natin kung ano ba yung mga parts na bumubuo sa kanya. Okay, my question is, what do you think would happen if one of those parts, or one of these parts, malfunction, or hindi gumana, or masigura? Ang sige yung mangyayari sa buong ball pen. Dagan? O kaya? Ang maayos? Di ba ba, tinanggal ko yung ball point. Ano ka ba sulat ka ba? Hindi na. Ano ka ba, nagsulat ka, ganito ka, walang ibang point. Mga ka ba sulat ka ba ng maayos? Although mga ka ba sulat ka, pero hindi maayos. Kasi nga di ba, tinatanong mo, mga ka ba sulat ka ba ng maayos? Hindi. Pero pag tinanong mo, mga ka ba sulat ka ba, yes. Pero hindi maayos. Hindi maganda pa ba. Okay? Same with us. Same with animals. Same with humans. We are composed of parts. Okay? So, kung isa sa mga parts natin ay nag-malfunction, hindi gumana ng maayos, the whole organism or the whole body of us will malfunction as well. Hindi gagana ng maayos. Okay? So, let's start with the one or the smallest one. Yung pinakamaliit. Okay? We have cell. Are we all familiar with cell? Familiar ba kayo sa cell? Yes, sir. Okay, so narinig nyo na ba ang word na cell? Yes, sir. Baka nito nagbibig na rin yan sa white blood cell, sperm cell, egg cell, white blood cell, tama? So those are examples of cell. So what are cells? Pakipasa mo nga, Shimaila. So cell, thank you. So cell is the most basic unit of structure, or simply the basic unit of life. We are composed of different cells. Okay, we have white blood cell, we have red blood cell, we have sperm cell for, for boys, we have uh, egg cells for girls, we have bone cells, skin cells, we have heart cells, we have muscle cells, are you more reproductive cells? Not, and we have brain cells. So those are cells that the humans are composed of. Right? So, kapag wala ang mga cell, then life 
who exist, exist. Ibig sabihin, hindi ma- walang magkakaroon, walang buhay sa pagwalang cell. That's why it is called a basic unit of life. Okay? So this is an example of a cell. Okay? And also, a cell has its parts. We have the nucleus, or your nucleus, we have the cell membrane, or your cell membrane, yung nasa labas, yung all the parts that we have the cytoplasm. Okay. <coughs> We will go to talk about cell or more on cell on a different topic. My, my separate topic for cell. But for now, let's stick to the point, the point that cell is defined as the basic shape of life. We also have types. We have plant cell and animal cell. Example of a cell is the red blood cell. Are we familiar with red blood cell? It carries the oxygen and nutrients na kailangan Okay, so uh, nakakita na ba kayo ng cell? Of course, hindi pa kasi wala tayong microscope, di ba? Pero ano ba ang itsura ng cell under a microscope? Kung yung nakita niya kanina is a cell, yung kanina, <coughs> this one is a cell under a microscope. Okay? So, ang process na ginagawa nila na, 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 na maaaring kabilang sila sa process na is called the cell division. Okay, so this is the process. Cells, pag maraming cells, they, they form tissue. 
Umami tissue they form organs. Okay? So to perform a specific function. So what's the function of our heart? Okay, very good. It is to pump blood throughout our body. What about our brain? What's the function of our brain? Now. What's the function of our brain? It is the control center of our body. So all the activities of our body is controlled by our brain. Okay? So what are the other organs that you know? We have the nose, ears, ears. lips, eyes, no, <laughs> no, the skin. Yes. <laughs> What's the largest organ of our body, by the way? Eyes. Largest. It is the skin. It's the largest organ of our body. Okay, let's go higher through organ systems. Okay, of course, organ systems, examples, we have a muscular system. What about that one? What is that? Oh, by the way, it's the head of a chicken. Okay? The head of a chicken, and that system is called the nervous system. What about that one? We have the heart, we have all the cells. Okay, it is circulatory system. Why? Because we have time to get to that. The other organ systems that we have, we have respiratory, endocrine, excretory, we have skeletal system, we have digestive system, integumentary system. Okay, so last one. Nasa tayong mga tayo ng ng level, ng organization. We have organism. So, yun na yun. Okay, okay. Yung mula doon sa pinakamaliit, yun na yun. And that is, uh, yun na yung pinakamataas, pinakamalaki. Yun na yun. So, what is that? Two pounds. Two pounds. Two pounds. Yan. Hindi ako kabarang po. Ako yung Panda. Panda. Ay, sa panda. Panda yun. Panda. It's a panda. 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 What about that one?
So, wala na tayo. Okay? So, uh, pakukuha mo na. Uh, per group, pakilabas nyo na nyo yung mga materials. Okay? We have, of course, ang ating material, yung mga material na pinagalaw ko sa inyo, uh, we have color play, we have illustration board. Where's your illustration board? Ano na lang. Okay? So,